Hello, welcome back to Undertale. So, when we last left off, we left off at quite an interesting spot. We could ask Toriel if we want to go home or not, but I didn't want to because I feel like that's going to open a can of worms that I didn't want to deal with, but we have to do it eventually, and that eventually is now. Let's see here. Uh... Oh! 72 uses for snail. Oh, she's saying something new. How about it? Oh, okay, I can see how this is gonna be. She's gonna keep droning on about other things and not tell us how to leave. But we can listen to her. Sure, why not? Here is an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails have a chainsaw-like tongue called a radula? No, I did not know that. Yeah. <laughs> Well, bother me if you need anything else. <sighs> How do I exit the ruins? I have to do something. Stay here. Like hell, I'm gonna stay here. Time to run to the basement. Right? I'm scared. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. One way. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No! No! Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. No, but, you know, sometimes there are some mistakes that we have to make for ourselves. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. No! You want to leave so badly? <laughs> You're just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh my god. Holy crap. Toyo blocks away. Huh, so she seems like she's not actually evil. Like, in a, in a weird way, she seems like she actually cares about us and just doesn't want us to perish because she's seen it happen so many times. That's why there's probably so many shoes, those previous humans. Holy, she is strong and she knows the best for me! Ho! Ho! Whoa! 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 Oh! Oh my... Jeez. Let's talk to her! Hey, Tora, let's, let's talk, mother! What?! Come on! Oh! What the- oh my god. Toriel, please! I'm trying to think of something to say again, but... Oh no! Holy crap, holy crap, I am dead. She prepares a magical attack. No, Toriel, please don't, I don't want to fight you! We have a stick. I don't want to hit her! We can't- can we flee? Ah! That is right! Go upstairs. That's not- no, that's not true. What will it take for you to learn your lesson? Oh no! Now we restart the fight with like, lower HP! God damn it! Cause I- I don't know how to dodge this shit, okay? Oh god! We are dead! We're dead! We have 4 HP. I don't really want to use the pie, though. Because that's kind of a waste, isn't it? I don't want to fight her. I mean, even if we fight her, I doubt we can beat her. She has 80 attack and defense. Let's, let's talk. Let's try to try our best to dodge, although I don't think it will go very well. Oh. My. God. What? <laughs> Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. I don't want to kill her or anything. She 
Here's a magical attack. Really? I don't want to hit her though. But look, her attacks, she's kind of like, you know, like not letting me get hit. Doesn't it seem like that? Like she's not really hitting us. Come on! Is it because we have low HP? She's like trying to... No, there must be a way! There must be a way! We can't spare her because she's not yellow. <laughs> Please! Mommy! Mommy! Yeah, she's not... Oh, she's such a good mother! What the hell? She's acting differently though. Like, if we keep doing this... Will she just... Look! Look, the attacks are like literally going through to the sides on purpose. Oh my god. Best mom. Best mom. No, I'm convinced. If I... Like, it's going around... Okay. <sighs> Do you see that? It's not that even if I stand in the same spot, she doesn't hit me. If I try to go near the things, I can't. Because it goes away. Oh! Mommy, I don't want to hit you! No, there must be a way! How about the pie? Like, if we... I don't know, can we show her the pie instead of just eating it? <laughs> that was a waste. Oh god, now she's willing to hit us again. That was a waste of a pie. I don't want to hit mommy! I don't want to hit mommy! Oh, jeez. She has no- yeah, she has no mercy if we have enough HP. But if we're near death, then... No, this can't be it! Let's try, let's try. Oh god. She's like, what the hell are you saying, man? You- you sparing me? <laughs> no, I'm confident that we won't die, so... I'm okay with wasting a little bit of health here. Because I know... What? Did we seriously die? No! <laughs> you cannot give up just yet. Wellens! Stay determined! Well, that's a shame. No, I'm convinced we can do this. We can do this. Let's try to get back to the fight with her. And we'll see what happens. Alright, we're doing this again. You know, one thing I did notice earlier is that... When we did spare, she said, okay, at first, the first spare, she did dot dot dot, and then when we spared her again, she did dot 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 twice. So I'm thinking, if we spare her enough, will something change? Let's try this out. Oh, oh, my mommy! Whoa, mom, mother! Okay, if we try, see? There's two lines of dots now. So, I'm really, oh, wait, come on. Oh, she's doing something different. Three lines, three lines, three lines. Oh, oh my god. Oh my... Oh, god damn it. We can do this, we can do this. She's changing, she's changing. Oh my jeez, whoa. First time we made it without getting hit. Mom, what are you doing? Believe that happened. Mommy, please come to your senses. Attack or run away. No, I will. I will stay determined. Cause you're my mommy. What are you proving this way? <laughs> oh! God damn it! Oh man! Oh. Mommy, please fight me or leave. Okay, that one seems way impossible to avoid. Stop it! Oh! I feel like I should heal. Should I heal? Uh, yeah, I'll heal. Oh my god! G! Oh. Okay, mom. I believe in you. Stop looking at me that way. Hey, she's getting a little bit weaker, isn't she? Oh my god. Go away! 
No, I won't! Mom! 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 Please, Mom. Dot dot dot. Oh, gee. Oh. Hey, I'm getting a little bit better. Never mind. <laughs> Mom, please. Mom, I know. Look, she's looking sad. She doesn't want to attack anymore. Okay, good, good. We're at that point. Mommy! <gasps> I know you want to go home, but... But please, go upstairs now. I promise I'll take good care of you here. Oh, she looks so sad. I know we don't have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. <sighs> Pathetic, is it not? It cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You'd just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. <laughs> Goodbye, my child. Last look at her and also because I want to save but that's beside the point Mom, I haven't left yet so I'm not breaking any promises I'm wondering if I can get a like another slice of pie or something <laughs> god oh I don't think she's gonna be here anymore she doesn't want to see us Really? Aww. Mom! Mom! Is this really how it's gonna go down? Oh, look at our room that we didn't even do anything in yet. This hurts my soul. Oh my god. How can this be real? My mom! <sighs> I feel so bad because I was doubting her this whole time. I was thinking, you know, she must turn evil later, but she really did have our best interests at heart. Yeah, I'm just wondering if anyone else says anything different, but it doesn't seem so. We can never come back? Really? <sighs> well, this is the road we decided, so... This is what we have to do. Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Mommy Toriel. Thank you for everything you've done for me. I'm gonna go grow up now. And I'll, I'll make you proud. Even if we never meet each other again. Now I don't know what kind of dangerous perils will lie ahead of us, but it's the road we decided. We decided, no, we don't want to stay in the ruins. Oh my god, not you again. Clever, very clever. 
You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die and you'll die and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much more interesting. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Whoa. All right, so I think that's another indication that we're... Uh, I think we kind of fell into it, but I guess we're doing a pacifist run. Oh. I hope there will never be a day where we have to kill somebody. But, you never know. I'd like to thank the little rabbit. Rabbit? No, not rabbit, the frog. I was thinking ribbit. <laughs> The frog that said we have to spare them even though their name isn't yellow. I think that was a little tip for us to save Toriel. <gasps> There's a camera in the, hidden in the bushes. Who's looking? What? That's scary. Okay. It's quiet. Huh. Really? Seems like kind of a random thing to ha <laughs> Help. <laughs> what have I got my- What was that? What was that? I'm shaking like a leaf right now. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Is that Comic Sans? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton? Like, Comic Sans the skeleton? <laughs> I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know... I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anybody. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Oh, that's like the exact same shape as us. <laughs> Sup, bro? You know what? Sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp? It's really cool. Do you want to look? No! I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready! I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the Great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. 
I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. <sighs> Maybe this lamp will help you. Sands! You are not helping, you lazy bones! All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. Why is that highlighted in yellow? A skeleton. Oh my god. <laughs> Sons! Come on, you're smiling. I am and I hate it. <laughs> Why does someone as great as me? By the way, that font he's using right now is papyrus, right? I recognize it. Have to do so much just to get some recognition. Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. Oh my god. Ugh. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> Whoa, I'm. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you can come out now. Oh, well, I'm gonna have to say, I'm not really voice actor material, but I'm having so much fun reading these lines right now. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Oh my god. I love this guy. Just to conveniently shape... This thing is shaped exactly we are. Holy crap. We, we can't hide under there anymore, but... That is quite eerie. <laughs> the lemonade stand. A checkpoint or a sentry station. But there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Someone's been- Oh! Is it a hot dog stand? <laughs> so it seems like these brothers, Sans and Papyrus. Oh. Actually, hey, hate to bother ya, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking. My brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. I don't know about that, man. That sounds kind of dangerous. But, I mean, Sans seems nice enough. And I love how they're named after fonts. That's pretty cool. The convenience of the lamp still fills you with determination. That is completely correct. I don't even understand why that lamp is like that. Oh. This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. So it's like a ender chest in Minecraft. Oh, I would love that glove. How do I use that glove? Oh, did I not get it? Wait. Yes. Can I please have... Yes, thank you. So let's see here. I don't even know what that did. I forgot to look at it before I equipped it. Oh, it's a weapon. Actually, we have to check. Uh, wait. I guess the weapon is 5 attack? Because in brackets it says 5 right now. So, our toy knife was three, I think. Okay, that's a better deal. Whoa. Whoa! Snow Drake flutters forth. Looks very threatening. Uh, heckle? <laughs> Let's check up on it first. This teen comedian fights to keep a captive audience. My fave ice cereal is frosted. <laughs> ah, you're, you're nothing. You're okay. Smells like a wet pillow. All right. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna heckle it because teenagers are like that. That's how we break teenagers. You tell the snow drake that they aren't funny. Insults towards humans. Yeah, you're small fry. I'm not afraid of you. <laughs> not yet. Uh, maybe. Okay, fine. Maybe we'll indulge in it a little bit. Ha 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 ha. Oh no. <laughs> okay, I got this. Uh, I'll joke with you. Bad ice pun? I've heard that one. 
Oh, you're so hard to play. Oh! My god. <laughs> How can we do this? We've done everything here. I don't want to fight. Heckle it some more. Boo! Okay, that doesn't seem like it's working. Oh! Wait. Wait. That's a different attack. So maybe if we heckle it some more. Oh, that's mean. That's really mean. <gasps> the struggle to make a retort and slink away utterly crushed. Lots of gold. Not complaining. Alright, we're just gonna save that one. Oops. Save that one time and I guess we will go to the right. Oh no, there they are. Okay. That means we're gonna go here first. Oh! It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Sure. There is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. <laughs> you send the line back out. Can we get other things? Aww. Why not, man? I mean, <gasps> can we still call? Oh my god. Should we, though? I mean, if we love her, and she told us not to come back, and never contact her again, shouldn't we respect her wishes? Oh my god, I feel like my heart is filled with pain thinking about my mom. Oh my god. I miss her, I miss her after all. I don't think she'll pick up. Holy crap, my heart. <sighs> so, as I was saying about Undyne... Hi! Are they dancing? Hello? Sans! Oh my god, is that... A human?! Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh. Hey, what's that in the front of the rock? Oh my god! Is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undyne will... I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular! Popular, popular! <clears throat> Human! You shall not pass this area! I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you! I will then capture you! You will be delivered to the capital! Then... Then! I'm not sure what's next! In any case, continue only if you dare! <laughs> oh, he's so cute. Well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket up for ya. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> That rock, though, it's gone. <laughs>